there, but there. <clears throat> That's what we're looking at. Oh, stream. Looking pretty good. After a bust-ass day at work, too. Woo! Damn near 9 hours. 100. 111, I think I averaged. Well, separate story altogether. And I burned how many calories and walked how many miles at work. Oh, brutal. Anyway, I welcome everybody back in to the live stream Let's Play of MLB The Show 16, where we are winding down pretty fucking fast with this, uh, well, chronicalizing this road to the show career of one Derek Metzger. And once we last left you, background music a little loud there, Mario Kart Rainbow Road for Super Nintendo. Anyway, um, we had a rough outing last time, tell you the truth. Forgot where it started, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, we lost it. One, two, three, four, five, one. Two, three, four, five, one. Yeah. A win and then two consecutive losses. Uh, 16 and 6 on the year. And we are nine games back in the division. Probably not going to happen. And we are tied with the Diamondbacks for the top wild card spot. Four games up on the Rockies, who we face now. Um, by tomorrow. Today being Thursday. By tomorrow, we should know the fate of what this whole thing has been. Because one, two, three, four, five, that's one, two, three, four, five, that's one. That'll be the last one we do today, but we will sim through. One, two, three, four, five. So we will show you uh, the San Francisco game will start us off tomorrow. One, two, three, four, five, one. Two, three, four, five, one. So our next episode, the regular season's done. Do we make the playoffs is the question. I mean, there's a little bit of anxiety going on right now because, well, I feel we're a, a playoff caliber team. We're not good in the clutch, apparently. But we might not make the playoffs. And I, I don't think we're winning the division. I would love us to, so we can at least get that by. Melberry's welcome into the live stream. Let's play of MLB The Show 16. Baseball, and it's getting clutch now. So clutch it's automatic. Kind of like me. But that's my own little tagline. I'm so clutch, I'm automatic. No one else used that. Patent pending. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so three games... Yeah, three starts today. Three tomorrow. And we will see if our final season here, season 12, if we go to the playoffs, and then what happens from there. I mean, if we ass out and we don't make it tomorrow... That's it. The live stream Let's Play of MLB The Show 16 will be done tomorrow. Who knows? But we gotta chug away with this. What do I think about ladies with bright colored hair? Like blues and pinks. Done properly, it can be kind of cute. Done properly. I mean, if it looks like, you know, just... a lame-ass job of it, nah. Not so much. Plus, I guess it also depends on if they're just doing streaks through the hair, or if it's the full scalp down to the roots colored. Plus, it depends on what their normal hair color is. Because if they got, like, dark hair, and they try going, like, with a blue, that might not show as well. But if they go for, like, pink streaks or something like that, that can look pretty hot. You know, they do it with, like, you know, dark hair, and then they got, like, the bleach streaks. Unpermanent, of course, but it'll be lame because I'm doing it yourself. Potentially. I mean, if you get good uh, products and shit like that, maybe some help ain't gonna hurt. Because, I mean, I know if you're going, like, for full-on, like, hair dye, you gotta know to Vaseline your around your hairline and all that shit to where you don't want it to go, and it's a mess, and you'll probably have to get a good amount of cleanup going. Wear clothes you don't like, or, honest to God, like, put a trash bag over you. You know, like, kind of cut a hole so your head can go through, and I don't know. Give give that a try, though. And, of course, I mean, if that ever comes through, I mean, if you're thinking, uh... If you're thinking weird colors, sure, pictures, why not? Just don't do that Harley Quinn thing. Please don't. Because, like, okay, that was cute for about a month, and then you started seeing a lot of chicks trying to do that shit, like, give it up. Or, or like, even the eyeliner or stuff. It's like one eye was like blue, one eye was, I don't know, purple or something. Green and purple, I guess. 
I don't know. So like, really know what I'm talking about? Well, I know girls who do hair stuff. And I used to have long hair back in the day. And they would have loved to dye my hair and braid it and they wanted to dreadlock it and all this stuff and... But yeah. Well, either way, you're dealing with dye. Ever tie-dye some shirts or something like that? Or do, uh, like, uh, silk screening on shirts? Printing? It's a mess. And you're dealing with your skin, your scalp. Whoo! Careful on that one. You don't want to end up like me. <laughs> no. I'm not like this because of, uh, hair dye incidents. Anyway, I need to get three games going here. I'm kind of tired today. I woke up just feeling very zonked out. I mean, if I woke up at 8, I didn't feel good until probably noon 30. Look at our pitching! We are number one in ERA, runs allowed, and fewest home runs allowed. Batting, 7th in average, 13th in RBIs. That's middle of the pack. Stolen bases are pretty good, but... Eh. 7th in average, 13th in RBI. We need more out of that. Wish our RBI numbers were better. So, offensive productivity, not good. Our pitching is phenomenal, outside of strikeouts. But still, everything else is beautiful. Alright, show me a good stat. Last month, 3-0, 46 innings pitched with 43 strikeouts. Woo! 9, 18, 27, 36, 4... So, 5 games worth, 12 earned runs. It's pretty fair. My last outing was a loss, so why would they show anything there? He made it to the seventh inning and then shit the bed. Uh, cheap, I tell you. Cheap. Yeah, when I had long hair, the girls were all about... Like, I don't even think they liked me. I think they just liked my hair. <laughs> oh, and we're on the road here in Coors Field. Whew, what do we got? We got... Nothing in the top of the first. Leading off for the Rockies. Center fielder. Oh boy. Steven Nishii. Nope. Ball Can't one. even start with a strike. It's gonna be Ball one of those one, days. No Can't hit outside. the zone. This is terrible. This is terrible. Well, but he went for that one and Oh nice. Good thing he's out. I don't see that song. I gotta take it out of the list. It's just too much. It's just too much. Dana Dorda. And their pitcher is Robert Rowe. They got a bunch of alliteration going on here. Love the alliteration. Literally love the alliteration. Well, that was he's fair. Alright, fuck him. One pitch out. He go. I'm almost done with this career, gotcha. Melberries. There will be no more baseball for quite some time, I could imagine, after... Potentially after tomorrow. If not, Sunday is probably going to be the wrap-up. Maybe even Saturday. I'm almost done with Grand Theft Auto V online. I could just do it then and be like, nah. You know what I could do? Well, no. I don't want to do that. Down the line. Oh, but it's caught. I'll be damned. Another one pitch out. Woo! When did the shirtless stream start? Um, you know, if I work on the core a little bit, get some more definition going. <laughs> it is a little warm here today in South Florida. Like, that's a fucking shocker here in early August, right? Nothing, dude. Did we strike out three in a row there in that inning? Come on! Leading off for the Rockies. Didn't Standridge hit a home run off me once? Stanbridge. Quite possibly this year. Oh, Come on, dude. That was perfect timing. Hit the zone. I should just hit this guy for fun. One Over the top of that down. slider, dude. 88 miles an hour ain't nothing. Ricky Holiday. That's a great name altogether. Ricky Holiday. You should be like a pro wrestler. Damn, oh, but right to the second baseman, out. and he's out. No strikeouts yet, it's already the second Got inning. I mean, I think shutouts are more important. Mendoza. 
I mean, yeah, like, it, that's easy to get, you know? Yeah! Well, let me, uh, let me give Hold you a, a quick... Hold on. There, that's chat only. That is chat only information right there. Just to give Mailberries the 411. No balls, two he strikes. threw his bat. Oh my god. I don't think I've ever seen that. I don't think I've seen a guy lose his bat while swinging in this game. Oh my god. 12 fucking years, finally. There you go, Melbury. So that's that's what we got going on there. That's my plan, damn it. And that, as you know, will be a long-term deal. Because that's... Well, but that that's kind of the... Uh, that'll be the pickup from this. It's not sports, thankfully. Right fielder, Angel Santana. I mean, I can't say thankfully. I don't mind playing sports games so long as they're good. This one, I do feel, does try to rip you off. NBA 2K17 was just... Bad control. Uh, bad programming, my opinion. Mild enjoyment, but... Well, I don't even like mild fucking salsa, so... Not a fan of mild. I kind of like hot. I don't like mild women. <laughs> Kind of like them hot. Medium's okay, too. Organic would be nice. <laughs> of course, then again, if she is. Woo! D different scenario. Totally different scenario. Damn! Strike this guy out here. That's down the line. Oh, he's retreating it. Oh, but he's got it. Okay, good, good, good. Still nothing doing both ways, although they do have a hit. There goes the goddamn perfecto. Forgot to say it. Look at that. It's kind of nice. It's kind of nice. A goose flew into some power lines, leaving 7,000 people in your city without power. Wow, like, I, I remember back in the early 90s when we first moved up to the middle of nowhere, Wisconsin. Apparently a squirrel, I don't know, fried himself on, like, the head fucking, like, power and light transformer. And shut out a whole chunk of the county. A fucking squirrel. Like, sadly, yeah, I don't, you know, I don't like hearing that about animals or anything going on like that. But a goddamn squirrel knocked out power for... I mean, that's just weird. Yeah, way to go, Squirrel. You had one job. <laughs> if he was a flying squirrel, then we could say he had one job. But, now that I'm batting, what are we at? Down low with the four-seamer. Nope, not yet. Mm, kept it up high. Down four, because that's what I believe he's going to do to me. Maybe not. Just outside. Bring that thing down low, meathead. Not yet, huh? Nope. Woo, he's missing. He's he's trying to push outside everything, though. Mmm, up top. He must have been nuts. Yeah, nuttier than squirrel shit, right? Anyway, this guy, I didn't even look. Uh, well, the sinker is essentially a two-seamer, so let's just say two-sink, slide, and change. That one's way low. And not gonna Three, do. Two. Um, down change up. Not today, huh? Oh, boy, I'm surprised. That should have been a strikeout. Tried giving me that high heat. He's keeping everything up though. He has been. Solid shot, drop in there. I'll stay at first. Thank you. Base hit, but there's two outs. Well, I don't know. Do I try stealing? I mean, I don't see why not at this point. Oh. Oh. I mean, where's Boris and Natasha when you need him? Must kill Moose and Squirtle. Just puts him onto fucking electric circuit breaker. 
He'll have no chance but to fry his nuts. He'll take out half of county, but eh. That's what they call, what is the word? Collateral damages. <laughs> So that would that would have been the one to go on. Oh, and they got his ass. Shit. Well, I was actually joking about that last night. I was uh, watching someone else in the. What community was that on Twitch? In the small streamer community on Twitch. Um, I figure why not get involved with some of those groups to try to, you know, help each other out and whatnot. But, uh... She was playing The Walking Dead Season 2. No and, of course, there's a little bit there with, like, some Russian people. So, of course, like, that's all it was in chat. Hey. Yesterday was goddamn... I was at work yesterday while, while watching that, but holy fuck was yesterday just a bad day at work. Today wasn't fun either. But that's why I call it the shit job. Yesterday was a... Oh. A radio day. Technical difficulties, which rarely happen. It's usually someone fucks something up. It's like, alright, if I let somebody borrow my car, and then when I get my car back, it's all fucked up. You know, the mirror is spun backwards and all upside down, and the fucking the seats are jacked, and, you know, maybe there's a flat tire and all that. Hey, that doesn't mean I'm a bad driver. <laughs> the person who used He's it last. That makes me look bad. That's kind of what happened there. User error, holy fuck. Like, ship station for Miami Marlins baseball. So, all the affiliate markets are relying on us to be smoother than a silk shirt. We gotta be slicker than come on a gold tooth when we're doing this. Nope. Nope. Hey! The, the start of the broadcast, there were so many problems. Because people were, like, shit was just all fucked up. Switches were thrown that we never use. It's like, if we never use these fucking switches and buttons, like, how would I even think to... Oh, yeah, let me just flip this back. That's what the problem is. No, no, it, it's a... It, it's like a... It's like a flight deck panel. Let's throw that ball. There we go. It's like, sure, you know where the landing gear is, you know where the other... But if there's one thing wrong that you're never used to touching. <laughs> there's one lever, there's one button, there's one dial, one switch that you never fucking use. You'll never think to look at it. And even if you do look at it, you don't know what it looked like before. Is that, is it supposed to be, you know, this way or this way or this way? We don't know. <laughs> Come on, guys. We get runners on and we can't do shit with it. I don't think I've struck out anybody. For the Rockies, and we're still doing well. Well, they haven't scored, I guess. But anyway, so as I'm at work, you know... Yeah, so we were making a whole bunch of, like, Russian jokes while watching someone stream uh, The Walking Dead Season 2. One ball. Because, yeah, there, there's some Russian people in that game. So, of course, you know... Gotta make your jokes. There's a screwball for the first punch out of the day. And honestly, I would love to get a lot of strikeouts. I would. Catcher, but two, me getting wins, Orlando, me getting shutouts, <laughs> the team winning, yeah. that would be way better. I mean, if we could win the fucking division, that instantly puts us an extra day to play. Because honestly, tomorrow, tomorrow could be the last episode of this. And I'm really not prepared for that because that's kind of a short window. If I wake up early... 6 o'clock in the morning, do a workout, and maybe start streaming around 8. Um, I don't have a whole hell of a lot of time to close out and reflect and do all those things, and goddamn, perfect shot down the fucking line for an easy stand-up double. Because the game says, fuck you. We know that your ability's well, jacked up through the roof. First but it doesn't matter, because you need to be taught how to fucking lose. Like I'm telling you, those weak little shots up the middle. Oh, motherfucker, go home with it. He's slow. You should get him. Oh, he's not even running. God damn it. Now 
Well, there's one out. A. Uh, I don't want this pitch. I do not want that pitch. Not fond of this one either. Now we got to do no something ball, in. Strikes. Not a bad idea. Bad placement, but that's out number two. So any out is a good out right now to prevent the fucking run. Whew. I think I was saying something there. Totally forgot right. what it was. Angel I got some other ideas as well for my uh, my short summer series that I've been going through. There was nope, Shovel Knight, Axiom Verge, there was Hitman. I'm still working on Hitman, having fun with that. that that's a game that I could go back to and, uh, and keep having fun with. Steven Cash Duckett, welcome into the live stream Let's Play of MLB The Show. I'm with you, man. Woo! Oh yeah, but I had other ideas for my short summer series. A couple of things, I don't want to like say anything to... Maybe put a thought in your brain like, oh, that would be awesome if you did that. So, I got ideas, though. I got ideas. Now batting. Same Metzger. pitcher. Derek Metzger. Hey! Oh, now he throws the sinker. That thing had a... Oh, I didn't catch the speed on it. Didn't look great, though. One Pitch ball, out. Oh, ho, they're scurred. Scared of Mr. Base Path guy. He is fucking fast, though. He is vera vera fast. Again with that shit? Come on, he ain't going. Maybe I should send him to go. Hitter will take a pitch to allow me to steal. Oh, make the runner on first attempt to steal. I guess... You know what? Damn! And course couldn't get under it. How early can you start saying it's 5 o'clock somewhere? Like 2 p.m.? Um, whenever. Shot up the middle of if he was running there. Oh, he's gonna go to third. And he'll make it standing up. Well, hell, I, you know, I should almost try to steal. Center fielder, Jonathan Holman. Ah. No, he's in there. Didn't get me. All right, now that eliminates the double play. That's why I did that, even if he caught me. Well, no, that wouldn't do anything, because uh, this guy would need to get on base regardless. I'm not going, though. Foul, God damn it! we had an easy two runs there. Have I seen you with the green screen? Yes, I, well, I haven't seen the green screen, Steve-o. That's because, <laughs> you know what I mean. It means it's working. All right, there's a good fucking two-run hit there. Woo, we'll slide for fun. All right, two to nothing lead. Beautiful. That was good. I had a decent hit. The guy advanced, went to third. I have not seen the green screen, Steve, well, because it's working. So that's a good thing. So, no, but that that's... Like I said, it hides everything behind you. So uh, so you can see more of the game. Well, the so the viewer can see more of the game. But, uh, no, that's... It's a good setup, actually. Probably better than mine, because I know I, like... Leading if I move my hand lead. like this, you can kind of see... It's not Second the best camera. Right. It's just my PlayStation Chris. camera. Bravo. I don't know if uh, higher quality cameras are better or... Well, I could use proper lighting would also help, but uh, no, I'd probably say you got you know just a damn good setup as uh, anybody out there. So that's always good because sometimes I mean it, it's kind of neat to see like oh, it's foul. Thankfully, some people have their stream set up and it's like you can see like the the whole back side of their room like they got their little computer desk over there, uh, oh, that's a little workbench or something, or maybe it's like. You know, sitting there like uh, that side of the apartment, there's the fridge and everything, or you can see the, the hallway down the way. And eh, that's kind of just like them welcoming you into their house. But 
my thought is, I want to see more of the game, strangely enough. Like, if I want to make a video to where... Three! Like, ooh, circle change up for the strikeout. If I want to make a video where, like, hey, here's my fucking shitty little double-wide prison cell, I could do that. The batter. I could easily Third, do that. It wouldn't be entertaining. <laughs> It'd be kind of sad. Um, I was watching a little bit of Tales from Borderlands, but I didn't want to watch too much because I might end up playing that myself. I didn't want to spoil anything. But, uh, I did check a little bit. Whoa, What's weird can't. is, like, I didn't recognize, uh, the characters, so I don't know if they're... Unless that's from Game, uh, Game 1. I'm very familiar with Borderlands 2 and the pre-sequel. So I don't know when, uh, when that takes place in the storyline. But I didn't really recognize hey. anybody, so I'm like, okay, yep, that's, two and one. that's fair. But it was something like they were just... It looked like they were going into... What the hell was the name of that city? Ooh, thankfully that's foul. Well, they were being chased. And they had to open the door to get in. Kind of thing. <laughs> that's, that's where I was. I was like, wait a minute, I don't know these people. And what are they running from? And what's going on? Is someone gonna die? Look at that, I'm number four ERA in the National League. Got my teammate, Fernando Marmalejo. He's under 1.7, that's tremendous. For a teammate of mine to be doing that fucking well. Just imagine if I was doing equally as gooder. Perfect timing shot. Oh, and that's a, yeah, shot to the corner. Sure, sure, on a perfect timing pitch, mind you. Sure. God damn it all. When this game doesn't want you to do well, you won't. However, any out is a good out. Yeah, there's a gap shot to bring in a fucking run. I love this game sometimes. Oh, speed of 70, he'll make a he'll make a triple out of it. Yes, he will. Jesus Christ. So one guy gets a cheap shot. That guy fucking blasts one. Whoa. Wrong deal. Wrong deal. Left it up too high. Motherfucker comes in. Tied up two to two. Fuck my life. God damn it, game. Why? Like, all this ability I have. Catcher, number two, Fernando Oliva. Okay, now I'm just, like, looking at shit here. Or is my confidence that far gone? Come on. I thought it was supposed to have, like, 99 clutch pitching ability. And that's a strike. Come on. Come on, um. Two balls, one strike. Yeah, now we're just going to miss by a fucking week and a half on everything. Down chop, get somebody. Yeah. All right, get him out of here. Fucking tie ball game. Both teams two runs, both teams six hits. And I'll be the number two better so long as they leave me in. See, I hate this. Either we get into that deficit and we can't climb out of it, or we get a lead, but they get it right back. Gotta be kidding me. Uh, from what I've checked, Steve-O, it's, uh, with your videos, um, like, there's not a lot of talking from you. I mean, if it's just gameplay, uh, that's one thing, because, I don't know, I'm, I'm kind of, dare I say that I'm big on that, like, seeing the reaction of the, of the, uh, the gamer. So that way that the viewers can kind of get an idea. And I don't know, you kind of play to the camera and stuff. But you tend to be a lot more quiet. Oh, look at that perfect punch down the line. Oh, I'll be damned he caught it. Surprised I didn't get ripped off there. It was a perfect pitch. But uh, with a lot of your videos, uh, you tend to be pretty quiet with it. As far as, uh... Like, you could be giving your opinion, like, well, I, you know... I like this character because, or I don't like that character because of this. Especially Tales from the Borderland. It's uh, that's the Telltale game series is all about the character.
and the decisions you make. Um, I mean, to do things like that where, like, maybe you describe He's why out. you're doing what you're doing. I mean, it's tough for me to do that with baseball, I know. I kind of have to get a topic or I just get so locked in, like, fucking, I need to throw a strike. But, uh... And yeah, even with uh, Resident Evil 7... Um... I mean, yeah, if you think that chick is just crazy as shit, or why doesn't she die, or what's going on... No, you know, to kind of... You kind of got to give something of yourself to the viewer. Give your opinion. Give some thoughts. Just talk about your day. One you know, one. what happened? Did you? Well, no. Thursday, you uh, you worked today, didn't you? And even if there's nobody there, still, if they go back to watch that episode, did he go? There's something there for him. Yeah, I would just say maybe just to uh, to chime in a little bit more. Grounder, throw that ball, please. Thank oh. you. Inning over, I think I'll be the number two batter. It's the end of the sixth. This is top of the seventh. He walks. They pinch hit for me. I could have hit into a double play. Game over. We won? I don't think I won, though. No, I couldn't have. It was no decision at that point. It was tall, all tied up. Well, we won. That's the good news. I would have rather gotten the win, you bastard. <laughs> Through six innings, only two strikeouts. It's like they were just putting putting good wood on the fucking thing. Piss me off. Eh. 3,000 career innings pitched with a quality start. So there you go. I am an innings horse. Whew! It's a lot. 3,000 innings. So this Colorado series, we ended up winning the series two games out of three with that win. So... Game set. Simulated game. I don't do that shit. Simulated game training. That's out of the way. Baltimore. Oh, a bit of a home stretch here. Baltimore, let's see. We lose. We lose. We win. Great. Four games set with division rival Arizona. Game one. We win. We're eight and a half games back in the division. Two and a half games up in the wild card. And keep in mind, the Diamondbacks are tied with us in this spot, so we need to knock them down some pegs here. Needs to. Let's save the game. Damn. Ugh. Nasal issues. Allergens and such. I mean, I don't know if there's, like, if there's flowers or plants outside. Like, I always got it bad when I'm home. Not to say that it's, like, bad, bad, but it's not pleasant. Arizona, what do we got? We're eight games behind. Haha, -ha, the Giants lost. <laughs> I mean, we really need to start winning some fucking games here. Baltimore got us two out of three. That eliminates our two out of three against uh, Colorado, even though that was a division opponent. This is a four-game set with Arizona. Jesus. And we're home, and last I checked our home record, wasn't that good. Leading off tonight for Arizona. Boy, I sure could go for a 12-strikeout complete game shutout. That was not a strike, huh? Pitch, Ball inside. How am I missing by that much? Come on, man. Perfect shot. Well, good thing he played it. Perfect timing pitch, excuse me. In the second spot tonight, Jerry Mendez. Your last Jerry name is Mendez. You named your kid Jerry. I don't know. What is, like, the Hispanic twist on the name Jerry? Like, Geraldo? Is it going to be, like, Jerry, Gerald? I don't think it's quite Jeremiah. But that could be. This is Jerry, Jeremiah. I mean, I guess I'll go with Geraldo. Left fielder, Harvey Clark. People driving Melberry's crazy tonight. That's what work does. 
There is no winning, it's just degrees of losing. But yeah. Oh, two is the count. Slider for the strikeout, and I get one early. I only had two strikeouts against Colorado. You can't answer tech questions, but this guy didn't want to talk to a tech. He wanted you to answer his questions after I clearly stated you cannot. <laughs> And Steve-O says on Saturday he's going to a barbecue after he gets back. GTA 5 Online. You know, Steve-O, honestly, I might be done with GTA 5 Online. It's just I'm running into the same circles of doing the same thing, doing the same thing, doing the same thing. I was playing off-air the other night, hey! and I was just thinking, like, what am I doing? <laughs> like, I am getting oh, bored cool. with it. There's... It's just, let's go, you know, I gotta restock my bunker, restock the counterfeit run. Like, even when I do that, it's like, I'm gonna sell my counterfeit run. Okay, then I got the uh, the bunker to go. There's not so many missions there, it's just keep resupplying it so the money's there. Uh, there's no real, th there are, like, missions you can do with it, but, I don't know. I'm kind of, I'm kind of winding myself down from Grand Theft Auto V Online. We shall see how things go. I mean, I'll be around. I just don't know if I'll be playing that specifically. I might, but if not, don't be surprised. Well, like, yeah, it's like to do a bunch of heists to be kind of cool. I mean, of course, for the money. But even still, it's like, what am I doing with all that stuff? What am I doing with all that shkaron? Got it. Batting six. Catch it. Johnny I guess I just hit a Sharon. wall with the game altogether. And it's like, unless I want to oh. stay up until like 3 o'clock in the morning one, and no wait strike. until there's nobody else in that server to go do like all my big time running for money. Like, that's too much all the time. Gotta wait for the school kids to, you know, hit the pillow. Oh good, they'll, they'll, be, on, they'll be hitting the pillow earlier now. School, I think, starts, what, towards the end of the month here? Uh, was that, Labor Day or something? Solid shot to center because I'm just not putting it on the spot. If I were to redo the career of a pitcher, Cutter would be my number one pitch. That would be the 12-6 the to curveball. Probably then the sweeper. Hey! I would probably put a, a four-seamer as my number five pitch, so I don't know what the number four pitch would be. Ah! Just for, uh, no you know... Balls, two strikes. Just for frozen purposes. Aye! The screwball's in there for the punch-out. I know it wasn't quite in there, but still. I'll get robbed that time he gave me one. They got two hits. There goes the goddamn perfecto. A walk, a strikeout, and a double play. Guys, you're fuck. Ugh. I hate when I strike out. I hate when I hit into a double play. Although it's rare. How do my teammates do that left and right? I mean, you would think the, the skipper would be like, you know what, we need more batting out there. Pitching's actually really good. Oh, no, Metzger, can you, like, play in the outfield? <laughs> can we, like, put you out there and right? Would that be good? Punch over to second. Barely hopped to him. Barely hopped. Man, a, maybe I'm, like, I might be due for a cheat meal. I don't know when. But I might be due. Hey. Of course, then I'll probably wake up like... And I'll be serious too, man. Like, I noticed the change. I noticed the change. One ball, two strikes, the count. Good for party chat? Uh, potentially. That's... I can always check in with stuff. Ooh, that's an uppercut shot. Not gonna get far, though. It didn't look good. I mean, I'll see about Saturday, Steve-O. I'm not, uh, no guarantees, but I just feel that the end is near for me. 
Jerry Mendez. Oh, what, no stats? Why did you put the camera on me for that long? Come on, give me something. Don't just show me derping around, wait for the ball oh, to get in my glove. Complete fucking derping. Ball that just missed. Ah. Well, at least he fouled it off. Oh, oh but the sweeping curveball is up there. Dude, that was clean. You can't bitch about that. That shit was clean. That was like tied and downy fucking in pine saw clean. Like all up in there. Well, nobody's on base. Maybe it's my turn to do something, huh? What do we got here? He's, uh, he's a righty, so four split and change. Those both drop. Oh, it looked good. Little movement on that four seamer, I think. Little bit of movement. Same exact spot. Down four, I don't know. I would expect there's movement. Barely tap, 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 a rude that thing. I'm surprised I didn't strike out. That thing dropped. Had to be a changeup if my timing was that bad. That's all right, opposing pitcher. Leading off with the Diamondbacks, left fielder, Harvey Clark. Ooh! Oh. Good play by Mason over now here on first. Shortstop. Ryan Man, I got some kind of neck pain going on. Spinal pain in between my shoulder blades. I don't know what I should do tomorrow for a workout. When I like, I've been feeling to hit heavy cardio. Like, I'm not I'm not sore the next day. That's another good thing with my workouts. I don't oh, feel sore from doing cardio, which is really fucking weird. You know, jumping around, plyometrics and squats and all that stuff. I'm not feeling it. Should be out of play because I can't even move. Oh, jump in there. You could have got that. You puss cake. Damn. What do I do tomorrow? I don't know. Like, I do like doing some yoga when we're doing some good, some good stretching. I kind of like that to get the legs good. No, he's out. You know, just that good flexibility and, and range of motion is always good. But then again, I mean, if I can blast away, sweat out a bunch of gunk, get my cardio going. You know what I seriously, vainfully want? I want to get that nice, uh, get that nice definition in the abs. That's what I kind of really want. Damn, a one hopper. Almost perfect pitch. Hmm. The catcher, number nine, Johnny. But I kind of want to go cardio crazy and just get my body all. Uh, yeah, now that summer is kind of winding down, and like I don't really need like, you know, beach bod and all tanned up and everything. Yeah, as if that was going to happen anyway. Ball inside. But still. Perfect timing. Oh, he's retreating. Please get there. Good. Final out, apparently. Good. Well, I didn't do anything at the bat, so what do we do? Nothing, and nothing, and nothing. I thought we were a really good percentage team, like, seventh. Leading off for Arizona. Third baseman. We couldn't hit on a hooker right now. Standura. Nope, and that should be pretty easy. Well, baseball players, we got a couple dollars. One and one. Couple. Yeah. Whew. Bad pitch, but he just let it go. I got the count. One and two. Sweeping curveball, and he's gone. Woo! Man. Now Gary Second Friedrich. Lane. Wait a minute. Gary Friedrich. Did I play with him? That name's all too familiar. Aye. 
He might have been here with L.A. He might have been with the Yankees. I don't quite remember, but that name... Very familiar. Hmm. I don't have to look into that. Slider, and he went. Strikeout. Ooh, kill him. National League leading ERA as a team under three. Henry... Giants ERA is starting to slip. Dude, if we could just... Well, we would have to almost win out to win the division. But every game we play them is so fucking important. And we play them the last series of the season. But at that point, I mean, it, it might just come down to, you know, who's chasing stats or whatever. One Damn. Ball, two strikes. Surprised he didn't chase that thing. He'll chase this, though. He Ball didn't. You disciplined little son of a fuck you. But he went after that one, and that was even garbage. Slider for the strikeout. Was that all three outs by way of the strikeout? Be a lot cooler if it was. <laughs> we finally got a base hit. Holy fuck. Oh, next guy's out. Well, I'll be the number two batter in the comeback. Maybe However, I Arizona. need to be fucking picture perfect Center here. Benito Navarro. Eight. Woof. 71 mile an hour screwball. Down chopping that thing. Come on, sucker. Come on. You're going to strike out right here. One ball, two strikes. Damn it. Down. That was perfect timing. All right, Mr. Catcher. The screwball, he's not biting on that thing, so we got to go somewhere else. Damn. Down chop, perfect through the gap. Damn it. Jerry Mendez. Oh, and he hit a single, too, huh? You know what sucks? That was a leadoff base hit. Dude, that was perfect timing, and the placement was off by, like, a foot. Okay, maybe half a foot, but still. One and one. Oh, great. Aye. Didn't think that was going on. But he steals second with no issue. Why doesn't the fucking skipper tell me to, hey, try, try a pitch out? I got to count. Two and two. That was foul tipped into the glove, the slider strikeout. Dude, that was so far inside, I didn't think that was possible. That ball was way inside. It went in, though. Giggity. Uppercut shot going to center. That should be play better be playable. Looked like he lost it there for a second. And the runner stays at second, does not advance. Good. Any out is a good out. And that was a one pitch out. The batter, number seven. Even better. Shortstop, Ryan Hume. Hey! Hey! I got the count. Oh, oh boy. Do we get him? Do we got him? Pulls it foul. Sons of bitches, you know? The screwball gets him, and he's gone. Well, that ends the inning nicely. And again, getting a little bit of strikeouts there. Two of them that time. He flies out. I'll come up with nothing doing. The pitcher, Same guy. Three, Four split change. Ah. That was pretty hittable. Wasn't looking for it. There it is. Pull shot, but not far enough over his head. Damn it. There's that third out. God damn it. Leading off for Arizona. Blast that son of a bitch. I admit that. That was a power shot. 
God damn it, perfect timing and this guy gets on. How? How? Now batting. We are in the seventh inning. We can't get a fucking base hit. Which means no runs. Like, I have to hold these guys to nothing. For us to even have a chance. Get the front man. He's out. Get both men He's for the out. double play. Yes, little fist pump out of me. You saw that. Third baseman, number three. I don't want these guys That's getting anything going. Scandura. Why? Because we got nothing doing. This is a division rival right now. We got to knock them down a peg or two. Ball inside. Hey. Hey. Oh boy. Hey. Sinker's in there. Started a little high. That was very high, but playable and left, yes. Woo! Ladies and gentlemen, it's please rise for the seventh inning stretch. He's on with an error. There's an out. There's a hit. First and second. There's a strikeout. There's a strikeout. We can't fucking advance runners here. Guys on first and second, you've got to try to get somebody over. Don't just fucking stand around like a hack. I mean, guys on first and second, one out. We can't even advance a runner over. It's strikeout, strikeout, which is fucking just stupid of them. Slider and he strikes out. I don't care if they strike out, but us striking out, that's kind of a big deal. The pitcher number 44, Henry and again, like, why Francisco. the fuck can we not put together a solid game here? All one's the count. It's not as if we've been chipping away. We have one hit. Hey. We have one hit. I don't even know if anybody's been walked. How good is their guy doing? That sinker was too high up in the zone, boy. Slider, and he strikes out. We got a couple numbers running today. We're rolling pretty good on that account. Oh, sorry, we have two hits. <laughs> Forgot, they just had one. But there was also a walk. So, yes, I'm that angry I forgot what just happened. Punch down the third baseline. He's got it. Throw it, motherfucker. He's missed safe. him. Missed him, missed him, missed him. God damn it. He's got to get up and throw that thing. He's got to get up and throw. Ball that's outside. Ball that's outside, and this fucker can't even catch that shit. I mean, I should have just gone right for him, like... Not quite worry about this, but... I don't like this. And that one stayed up in the zone. There goes the fucking lead. There's the game. I'll get pulled. We can't do shit. God fucking damn it. Oh, I don't even get pulled. How nice of you, Skipper. Still got faith in me, but you don't do pinch hitters because no one else on this team can fucking swing a stick. There goes the goddamn shutout. Hey! If you need that in there for comedy reasons. Fuck it, I'm just going frozen. Because I don't think I'll get another shot here today. Hey! Slider for the strikeout. That's the good news. Inning over, but... Nothing there. Nothing there. And I get pinch hit for. Oh, the guy draws a walk. He draws a walk. Could have used the three-run homer right there. Fuck, man. One out, a walk. What happened there? Two outs. What's going on here? Last chance. One out. Two outs. Oh, a hit. Doesn't matter. We lose one to nothing. Fucking team. How can we not put anything together here? How can we not put anything together with the bats? This is fucking bullshit. So there's my seventh loss of the year because we lose one to nothing. I had 11 strikeouts. I had 11 fucking strikeouts. A lot of good that'll do me. 
quality start. We need to get better fucking bats on this team. Lose that game. Lose that game. This fucking team sucks. Lose that game. Oh, we win one. That's fun. We're eight and a half back in the division. Still only two and a half. Oh, yeah, but see, now we're the number two wild card. That's the problem. So here's our three game minimum right now. <laughs> here's that game. Yeah, good luck getting on any fucking stat list there. This fucking team. How? I give you gold for fucking seven innings. Well, even the eighth inning. I struck out all three guys. They just so happen to get a fucking run. Lose one to nothing. We cannot let this shit happen. Oh, fuck my life. Not a good look right now. Not a good look. Like, we, we need to- we need bats right now. Pitching is apparently good because, fuck, any- any pitcher would say, Dude, if all I'm allowing is one run today, I'll take it. I'll definitely take- yeah, if I'm only giving up one run today, that's beautiful. Yeah, but the fucking bats don't do jackrabbit shit. God damn it. This fucking team. Oh, good thing we're on the road. Apparently we're much better. <laughs> Eleven strikeouts in eight innings. And it's not good enough for a win. Like, it's not good enough for, like, one run was allowed, and I lose. One run is allowed, and I lose. That's just terrible. Like, the skipper needs to get his head out of his fucking ass right now. If the bats aren't doing anything, like, we're in the sixth inning. Hmm, we only got two hits. Get a pinch hitter. Do something. Make a defensive substitution. Get some new guys in here. I'm pitching a fucking gem. <laughs> and he should have let me bat either way. <laughs> he should have let me take my swings. I mean, well, what's the worst that could happen? I'll get out like the way everybody else does? What's, what's the difference at that point? I can strike out like those fucking no hacks. Ball, no strikes. problem. I can ground out. I can fly out. Not as often as them, though. Starting San Diego, there's a slider. God damn it. 38 home runs and 100 RBI, did that say? This guy's dangerous. They missed the spot a little bit, but... A little low on the sinker there. It sunk too much. Ball match outside. And I mean, it's tough to kind of, like, be happy right now when we're losing. Sweeping curveball. That's a strikeout. Just expletive-riddled fucking baseball. I mean, but come on, in a, it was one to nothing. It was one to nothing. And we lost. Like, how the fuck is that even possible? I strike out 11 guys. I'm playing a beautiful fucking game of the season. Leading out for the Padres. <laughs> Pretty much. First baseman. 11 strikeouts was probably my Boston. high for the year. Wasn't Ball even a complete inside. game. I only win eight innings. Shot to right. Short enough, though, and playable. Oh, man. So if tomorrow's three-game minimum looks anything like this, we might not make the playoffs, and that would wrap up the fucking career. That would be it, skis. Which opens up a big, big project that I have planned. Damn it. I thought, I thought we had a shot that game. Ended up with 11 strikeouts, but one run. Like, oh yeah, I'm pissed about that. But I'm more pissed at my own team. Like, if you're going to tell me, Mike, you're going to allow just one run today. Awesome. That's fine. That could be a complete game. We could win 7-1. to one. That's cool. A 
Barry Umber put that thing up. His body language is almost looking like, oh, look at that thing sail. Thankfully not. Can we get something going, guys? Put a runner on third, just for fucking, for fun. Let's just see how that looks. I haven't seen that in a while. A walk. Ooh, and now I'm up. Look at that. Somebody on with no outs. Batting ninth. Petra. Derek He's a lefty, Mexico. so splitter and changeup both drop straight down. So 2-4, changeup, down four. Be safe. Always looking for that down low four-seamer. Not always, but that's how I start things. Hey. Yeah, see, he's worried about this guy getting his fucking shit in right now. He ain't gonna steal. That's got, what, hey. 58 speeds? What? 58 speed ability of 68. He ain't stealing. Yeah, see, I can hit into a double play like anybody else. Why pull me out of the game, Skipper? Of course, I meant last game, but god damn it. How was that a bad one? I want to see where that placement was. Yeah, so that burns a leadoff walk. I know, I know. Leading off for the Padres. Catcher, Mariano. Did look in a very hittable spot, though, sadly. <laughs> I'm going to have to look at that on the comeback. Oh, boy. Broken bat! Oh, wait. Oh, get him, would you? Guys, you fucking cocksuckers. Pick up the ball, you barehanded people. Just, you have a glove. Let's use that thing. The guy breaks his bat and gets on base. I did not see that that ball was flying just, you know, that close to me. Nope, that's down. My God. This ain't working well. Yeah, maybe just time to retire after this year, huh? Let's just say that our, we've got arm fatigue. We've got some bad arthritis like Sandy Koufax, you know? Sweeping curveball, he's gone. Son of a bitch, yo. Batting ninth. Etcher, Carlos Almanza. Go to first. Well, you, you could have got a double play there. Well, he now pops up on the bunt and is baseball. out. Manny Not a good one. Carrara. Not a good one. Chop. And any out is a good out. Got him. Forced at first. He gone on one pitch. Oh, my God. I thought San Diego was like a bad pitching team. Guys, one out, guys on first and second, let's hit into a double play. Leading In the up the inning. fourth inning. Gotta be Third, fucking shitting one. me. Brady we do not string Bayern. together good frames when we're batting. We don't. The left fielder, number five, Patrick. Like, and as a, as a National League pitcher, it's like now I feel that much more pressure. Because remember, that was my whole thing. I wanted to make it into the National League so I could also, you know, start taking swings and, like, help my own cause. Well, fuck, it's not even that. No one else can do anything. So I'm kind of no like... Ball, two strikes. To the mercy of the game, if there is any. One ball, two strikes. It's like, yeah, we know you're pitching a fucking gym, but you're just, you're gonna lose this game, by the way. Just trust me on this one. Wait, I don't know about this catcher sometimes. Two, two, it's like, let's put the same pitch in the same spot. He wasn't looking for it then. Maybe he won't look for it right now. Well, you know, like the boy who cried wolf kind of shit? Let's not be that as a pitcher-catcher combo, you know? Well, that one went to the wall. Now batting. Luckily, the wind didn't carry it. Charles Boston. See, even when I screw up that pitch, that's okay, because it's going to drop in for that perfect strike. Two the count. Slider missing in that spot, not bad. See, but this, this I'm worried about. Wanted it a bit low, and we get the sweeping curveball to strike him out. 
Now let's do something, guys. There's a hit. A strikeout. He strikes out. I'll try to do what I can. Jesus. Up next for the Dodgers. 2 4 change. Metzger. And I didn't even notice that last one. I have no idea. Totally missed it. Ooh, that one was too low. You know, down change up. Hmm. The count is two and one. He's liking that change up, though. Well, he's confident with it. Damn! Well, shit, now it's a down low change up, isn't it? <laughs> isn't it? Perfect shot. Base hit. But again, there's another. I get a hit, but I, it's not able to advance the guy from first to third. He can only get his ass over to second. Now, now Mikey Don't Diaz, start. I don't know anything about Mike you. Diaz. Other than you're the leadoff man and your name is Mike Diaz. Could no, you please saying. get a base hit here? Prefer a ground rule double, I'll take that. Oh, that's okay. I mean, drawing a walk, not bad. Works out this guy's arm, but... Come on. Oh, boy. No, he's in there. Why am I so slow on the get back there? I'm holding return. I'm holding the down stick. The analog stick down, whatever. Too high. Oh. Fuck it, maybe... No, I don't know. Let me just take one step. Before, no, fuck it, two. Reno. Why am I not going back? What am I doing here? What am I doing here? What am I doing here? Okay, just checking. Safe. I will always return. Oh yes, I will. Stop trying here, buddy. Come on. Ball four. Hey, and he hey. walks on four straight pitches with a couple of, you know, pickoff attempts. See, so, you now second base, I think I only need to take one step because I'm not going to try that Zach shit. Montez. Ball match outside. I got over here. Nothing. I don't know. No, he must count. One and one. I don't think I've been on the bases for a Grand Slam. I've given one up as a pitcher. I've hit one. Ball inside. Woo. Two and two with two outs. Bags are juice, my friend. And you whiff it some shit down in the dirt. Well, we kind of had something going, but uh, no. Leading out for the Padres. Let me think about that. Two outs. There's a guy on first. We get a base hit, we get a walk, now they're loaded. But where it matters, we don't do. Man. It's like, I can't win for losing. But I can lose for winning, that's for sure. Just all I have to do is just play average. And the, the team isn't going to fucking do anything. Hmm. We got four hits, nothing doing. They only have one hit. Like, come on, guys. Whoa, that's down. Just got to throw them strikes and such, you know? Just got to do that stuff. Left that one up, but Barry Umber can't get a good piece of it. Yeah, you get that one now, huh? I like that broken bat shot. Oh, yeah, by the way, that was the only base hit so far for them, was now the broken bat of all fucking Mariano things. Mateo. 
That's just crazy to me. Down shot the first. Oh. One pitch out, inning over. Mr. Padre, Tony Gwynn. What a career he had. Are you kidding me? Like, it's insane. Only him and Wade Boggs in my lifetime were great uh, batting average guys. Nothing against Ichiro. Leading off for the Padres. So I think uh, age is it's starting to catch up to him late. Well, fuck, he made it into the major leagues at age 29 here in the States. He had quite a career over in Japan. Fucking guy comes over here. Rookie of the year, MVP, gold glove. He did everything. The pitcher, number did 21, everything. Carlos Almanza. I mean, he set the single season uh, hit record. And I know they play more games now than they did back then. Still, hey. he's playing professional pitchers. All ones back count. when George Sisler did it in like 1912... <laughs> Or whatever he would, you know, you know who the pitchers were that he was facing. Ball inside. Uh, a plumber, a carpenter, a farmer. You know, they weren't like professionals. Yes, they were paid to play baseball, but they weren't dedicating their lives, their careers, to playing baseball. So I got to put a little more credence, like, to think the more modern to stuff. Two and two. Hang on. Like, don't get me wrong. I think you know what. A lot of things that have happened in sports in my lifetime, like, oh, it's, it's been tremendous to see all these great things. Wayne Gretzky, Michael Jordan, oh. Peyton Manning, Tom Brady, Brett Favre, all the quarterbacks, Joe Montana, all this winning. It's great. But it's just, it's, I got to make the argument to all the, like, the old-timer talk. Yeah, the people that were good back then, I'm not saying Jim Brown wasn't good, but in today's NFL, come on. Babe Ruth, if you look at it from that context, and Babe Ruth was what, in the in the 20s? Babe Ruth probably, he'd be the smallest guy on any major league team right now. And back then he was like this, seen as a big guy. He would be the smallest guy on, on any major league team right now. I don't know, 6'1", 6'2", I forgot how tall he was, but even by body weight. Like, just not, just not doing it. He was like a stocky 220. Well, that's like everybody now. And he wasn't even like in good workout shape. He was just fucking yeah. gifted. Double Ow. play. Nope, force out's all we need. Well, good. Mason Montalvo, Ridgeway, the batters. A walk. Another walk. A force out where at first? That was weird. Ridgeway on a sack bunt to move everybody over. Okay. Now, Mike, you've got to just get that ball up. The He's been throwing a lot of splitters. Let's look for those. All right, there's a shot up. That'll get a sack fly going, or... Yeah, that should... I mean, the runner scored, right? Now batting, Please tell me the runner scored. Mike Diaz. I don't think he scored. Oh, he did. Thank Jaga for all you Thundercats fans. So a sack fly RBI by the pitcher. Leading off for the and we're up one to nothing. Left Jesus fielder. Christ. What kind Patrick of a team is this? Carlos. Relying on the pitcher to drive in runs. Now I know how Madison Bumgarner feels. Hey! Opening day this year. I was back. I was on vacation visiting my family. And that one's up. That's gone, apparently, because I can't move. Well, there goes the goddamn uh, one to nothing lead. Yeah, Madison Bumgarner hit two solo home runs. I think they were still game. You're fucking now. That's really off. Now it's really off. Two balls, no strike. He hit two home runs opening day. The Giants still lost. Ah. God damn it. You know, I all that work and we get the lead. 
What happens? Solo home run immediately afterward. Yeah, now they oh, can't get that one. Rolled right by me. Can't do a leg kick or nothing. This is pathetic. When this game doesn't want you to do good, you just won't. There's a double play, though. Thankfully. I mean, to get out of a jam, that's great. Now batting the shortstop. Barry Humber. Hey! Like, I didn't feel that we had the game. I really didn't. But a solo home run immediately afterwards. Like, have the bullpen fuck that up. Circle change up for the strikeout. So I got that going for me. Strike out a walk. Two out, strike out, sure. There's a hit that drives in a run. Wow, we got the lead. And the skipper's keeping me in. It's the bottom of the eighth. <laughs> Leading out for the Padres. Catcher, Mariano Mateo. Whew! Good snag at second. Bet you if that was a base Your hit, I'd probably get pulled. Kyle Schwarber. Kind of forgot Number he was 12. here for a minute. Kyle Schwarber. On one. But this is how I always see him now, is in a pinch spot, apparently. Ah. Another screwball down and away. Fuck it, let's just keep it rolling. And he reaches for the screwball, gets punched out. Three straight screwballs down and away, and he fucking whooped. The batter. Shit, they got two guys with complete games way up there. Well, I think I need this win and my last three starts as wins as well to get the 20. So I doubt that's going to happen. I doubt 200 strikeouts is going to happen. I doubt we'll win the division. Aye. Am I getting some lag here? I don't know. Sometimes it's looking like it. Shit. Up there. Playable to the wall. Thank God. That looked good and far. Oh, that's that's one of those that's one of those pucker shots, you know. You start clinching. Really, he's gonna let me take a swing here. In the top of the ninth. He's a lefty. Four cut slide and curve. Okay. Down low fastball. Curveball up top. Really weird. There's a solid power shot that just... No, it doesn't do it. Oh, I thought that might have done the trick. Got some warning track air under it, though. This James Duke down. comes in as catcher. Why? Number six. Okay. James so if there's any blame, it's on him then, huh? Nope. Ball one. We need this game. Nope. You know what's funny, though? No, no. You know what's funny? Battle music, Final Fantasy VII. Let's do it. Hey. Oh, 
Same fucking guy gets another solo home run. The game is tied. Unbelievable. Again, a screwball outside. So much for the uh, the battle music, huh? I think it proved its point. God damn it, all game. Ball that's outside. Pitch a gem. If I hit a solo home run, would have been no problem. <laughs> One ball, two strikes to count. Well, I'm clearly not making it into the final set here, so let's just... Uh... Three! Get the circle change up, get the strike out. Not much more that I can do. I'll let by two solo home runs to the same fucking guy, strangely enough. Two runs, five hits, no errors for both teams. Strikeout, double play. Wait, no, never mind. <laughs> yeah, see, now I'm done. Let's allow a hit. Force out at second. What happened there? Well, they're out. One out, there's a double. Fly out, no advance. There's a shot that drives in the go-ahead run. There's a shot, corners. There's a walk, bags are juiced. There's a shot that drives in two. Now we got corners, we're up five to two. Okay, done. There's a base hit. Strike out. There's a hit. Strike out. Fly out, we win. Five to two. I don't know if I get the win, I probably don't, because I gave up well, gave up the lead. Son of a bitch. But we win. But we win. <sighs> what did I get? Eight strikeouts through nine innings. I mean, that number looks good at the very least. Damn it. But still, like, two solo shots. And, like, we were struggling to get anything going there. Well, we won the series against San Diego, if there's any good news. Arizona, what do we got? A loss... A win, a loss. Pitch command, is it even worth it right now? I suppose for one last fucking session, you've got to be kidding me. I would have been okay with the 2-1 to one win, <laughs> but the same fucking guy hits the, the outside screwball, solo home run, out to right, then a perfect pull out to left. Unreal, man. Unreal. When this game doesn't want you to do well, <laughs> you won't. I mean, what, is it getting revenge on me for my early career with low difficulty? Is that what it's doing to me? Fucking with my life? Come on, game. Come on. Can't even hit shit now. Surprise I got that one. Let's just hit the target for something. For something, I suppose. Even if that something is just for fun, something. Consistency is the key. I still, like, I just don't get how... My pitching can be that hittable. I mean, well, Mike, no velocity on the pitches, etc. Maybe. But you would think, like, a screwball has not been this good since I don't know when. Fucking Fernando Valenzuela. Valenzuela? Did I say that right? <laughs> I'm not saying I got a good slider, because it's not. The sweeping curve is nice. Don't really know many people that throw that thing. Circle change? I don't know. Uh, 
Johan Santana? Come on, I missed that shit? That was so fucking close. Surprised they'd give me anything there. Give me the bullseye, you son of a bitch. Mmm. 1170. Oh, I needed that bullseye at the end. Oh, well. It's just, you know, stuff. Okay, so now this is where we line up. First game against Frisco. We lose nine to nothing. Marmalejo, Jesus Christ, you got torched, son. I have more strikeouts than him? How is that possible? Oh, and his ERA jacked up to 192. Well, that's where we start things. Let me, uh, I'm gonna save right now before we check anything else. Just to make sure I do. Man. Rough go. Rough go to close out this career. I mean, if this was early in my career and I'd be sweating this, like, that's different. But it's like, no, man, this this might be it. We are... We are ten games back in the division. The Giants have already wrapped up the playoff berth. We are four games up in the wild card position. That's the good news. I mean, don't even clown me that we might have a chance to do something here, because I doubt it. Uh, but anyway, it'll be San Francisco. One, two, three, four, five. San Diego. One, two, what, one, two, three, four. And at San Francisco. Those will be the last three games of the regular season, potentially of this career. I don't know yet. Because with a four-game lead for the wild card position, dude, we're three and seven in our last ten games. This fucking team can't hit for shit. Where's the good contact? I'm not seeing it. Just look in the division here. 597 runs. Gotta be kidding me. Well, we're not the worst somehow. But runs allowed. 508. By a long jump, we're better than anybody else with... with runs allowed. Just can't bet we're not good in the clutch. And we still have not made the playoffs yet, so... Man... This is going to be interesting tomorrow morning. It's going to be very fucking interesting. I don't know what to expect. San Francisco, San Diego, then at San Francisco. That is our last bit for our three-game minimum. I'm probably not going anywhere with uh, winning awards or anything like that. I think it would be such a incredible far cry to even get close to it. And I don't even think I have a shot here, what, 16 and 7? No, best I can do is uh, 19 wins. The year started off weird, then, like, as the team was getting better, I wasn't getting the stats. I was getting the wins early, sorry, I was getting the wins with horrible stats, then, I, as I was getting myself back numbers-wise, the team was slipping. Really weird fucking see. This season and last season were really fucking weird altogether. Just, ugh. But that's where we sit right now. Um, if this is a three-game set with Frisco and they fucking murdered us nine to nothing. In our own house, mind you. But, uh, yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten straight games at home. One is already out of the way. And then three on the road to wind it out. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's where it's gonna be. We'll see what happens tomorrow for the uh for the the finale of season 12's regular season i don't know if the career will be done but and i will keep track of the playoff run according to you know the who does what in the playoff tree and all that stuff i'll walk you through that day by day as it happens just to show you who wins what and how it goes speaking of that let's look at the other teams right now just to Whew, what do we got? In the AL East, the Blue Jays with a half-game lead over the Red Sox, the only thing of note there. In the Central, the White Sox own the division a game and a half over the Tigers, seven and a half over the Royals. In the West, the Rangers lead it three games over the Angels, 
five games over the Astros. Uh, in the wild card, it's the Red Sox and the Tigers. Who's behind within reach? The Angels by one, the Astros by three, the Royals by six, the Orioles eight games back. That'd be such a huge swing, though. Uh, in the National League, the Braves own the East. The Marlins are six games back. The Phillies are nine games back. In the Central, the Reds own the division. The Cubs are two back. The Brewers, four and a half back. That's still open enough for me to say, hmm. And in the West, of course, the Giants own the division. The Diamondbacks are seven games back. We, the Dodgers, ten games back. But yet still, uh, owning a wild card spot. The Diamondbacks and Dodgers owning those. The Cubs are four back. The Rockies are four back. The Padres and the Marlins are six back. The Brewers are six and a half back. The Phillies, nine games back. This is a jam-packed National League year. Not to say that the American League isn't, but I don't know. It's... Eesh. Just seems really jammed over here for some reason. Well, look at this. Diamondbacks, Dodgers, Rockies. And the Padres. This entire fucking division has a shot right now with... How, how many days left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Let's call it two weeks. There is two weeks left in this in the season. Two weeks left, this entire division has a shot to make the playoffs. I mean, it's not... Every team has a chance to get into the playoffs at this point, I'm saying. I mean, there's mathematically no way that can happen, because... Well, only two teams can make the wild card and one, key, one team can make the division, so... Still, three teams in this division could easily be... in the fucking playoffs. So... What's up with my phone? Oh, well. Whew. Yeah, our division, like, dude, this is the, probably the most competitive we've been. The Padres aren't even a 500 ball club. And they can still make the playoffs. Wow. There was a season recently, here with the Dodgers at least, so somewhere within the past four years, where I think the entire division was at least 500. So, going into this bitch, I knew it was a competitive division. But this year, boys, it biting me worse than anything. Like, if we don't make the playoffs, that ends the Dodgers. That'll be, what, 15 years straight? Something like that? Whew. Unbelievable. That's, the, like, I can't do anything right now. That There's nothing that I can do to help anything. <laughs> Where are my wins? 16 and 7. Um, I have 182 strikeouts. I need 18 in 3 starts. That's 6 per start. That's doable to hit 200 strikeouts. Um, who is the... Yeah, home runs allowed. You talk about some bullshit. Complete games, eight. Innings pitched. I'm still the innings horse. With three starts to go. Although that number did dip this year, for damn sure. Normally I'd be around that 250 range. But, uh, this year, Jesus... I mean, unless I can get, you know, three complete games, <laughs> that'll hit the mark. Jesus, ERA of 216, which isn't bad. That whip is terrible, though. I mean, since I got to the National League, it's been somewhere in the 80s. 83, 89, 88, 79 last year, 87 this year. I thought I had something. How the hell was 2024... So good for me. 19 and 4. Cy Young, MVP, all that shit. Not even 200 strikeouts. Whew. Man. Uh, we're getting down to the wire here, folks. That's the whole thing of it all. Well, let me just go to the calendar and look at it. It's Frisco, San Diego, then at Frisco. We are not a good home team, so... 10 straight days, well, it'll technically be 11 straight days at home. The first game's already done, and we lost. 10 games at home, and, uh, yeah, that's just shitty. This team just, it's upsetting right now. But, fuck it, I gotta get rolling. That's the basis of all this right now. Damn. Can we make the playoffs? Will this be the end of it? Who knows? I mean, tomorrow is gonna be a telltale sign of, uh, what the hell happens with this career, but... At least we have a flair for the dramatic going out like this. At the very least, I can give it that much. 
That being said, thanks to Mel Berries and Steve O checking in to say hey and talk a little bit. Everybody else who chipped in and chimed in here live on Twitch. Well, just to check things out. Some lurkers. No one else chimed in, actually. <laughs> but uh, for those that watch episodically on YouTube at your own leisure, thanks for checking things out for now. One more regular season episode to go. And from there, we'll just see, man. We will see. That being said, <laughs> MJ signing out for now. Till we meet again, everybody. Don't know when or where that's exactly going to take place, although I will be playing this tomorrow morning. Uh, hopefully you can make it or check in on it. We'll see. All I do know is that I will indeed catch you down the road to the show.